from uh, from Akhwat is about how do you forecast or read in the future in the next 10 years of the of Islam itself and how the youth should be prepared for that in coming days. My crystal ball is in the room. <laughs> so I cannot forecast what will happen in 10 years time. What is this? Now, why, why do I say this? I could, have, I could have said, inshallah, in 10 years' time, the Muslims will be stronger, the beards will be longer. And, but this is not reality. You want what's beneficial. What's beneficial is not what's in 10 years, what's today. You ask yourself, do I pray five times, on, uh, uh, five, five times a day on time? Oh, Fajr Sheikh, it's very early. I can't. I pray it at 7 o'clock and Duhur is this and Asr. Sometimes I get sleepy, but Alhamdulillah, Maghrib, I pray on time. <laughs> and you want a forecast after 10 years? You'll be in hell. What? Pray on time. Abide by the law of Allah, Azza wa the Sharia. Deal with Muslims like Muslims. If you took their money unlawfully, give it back to them. Don't cheat. Don't deceive. How is your relationship with your parents? Are you disobedient? Go and kiss their feet and say, I'm sorry and be good to them. How is your relationship with your kinship? I haven't seen my uncle in six years. Why? Because he lives in the next street. Subhanallah. You will never enter Jannah if you cut your kinship. And this is your forecast. Don't look about the Muslims forecast. Who cares? I don't care about you. I care about myself. If you all go to Jannah, and I go to hell. No, the hell with you all. You go to hell, I go to Jannah. <laughs> Let's be clear. I don't care about you. I care about myself. If I go to Jannah, inshallah, you all come. No problem. But I don't put you in Jannah and then, mm, maybe I go to hell. No. So don't care about the forecast. What will happen? Care about what Allah will ask you in your grave. What Allah will ask you on the day of judgment. This is all what you care about. As for the forecast, I know 10 years, 20, 100 years, Allah will make this religion victorious. So when Mahdi comes, when Isa, peace be upon him, descends, the victory would be inshallah to Islam. When? I don't know. But I will not wait and say, inshallah Mahdi will come. Okay. We need you to go and give a lecture. No, 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 Mahdi will come. Inshallah, everything is good. No, you have to act. You have to do something. You have to show Allah Azza wa Jal your sincerity and then Allah will take care of his religion.